Hello everybody and welcome back to another day on all the mods expert mode server. Oh ho. We still got plenty of food as you can see. And in the last episode I finally got this little thing set up where we can start getting some uh, good amount of copper. And I may have overheated this thing because it is taking um, quite a bit of time to melt down. I think this needs to drop down to under a thousand. So it goes into here, and I uh, I screwed up. I thought it'd be good just to throw up a whole bunch of uh, charcoal in there. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do that, because that thing got up to like 6,000 degrees. I don't know if that's intended or what, but it kind of caused problems. So today, what I want to do is I did notice that... Let's see, where is this thing? Ba, 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 ba. So for the next step in this book, it says I need to make this uh, atmospheric gauge and go look for some ember. But the problem is, I can get the copper, no problem. I get the tin, no problem. But a compass, a compass is an issue. A compass where are you? That requires something called petal dust. And I did play around with roots before, and I think petal dust is actually kind of hard to get but I'm not quite sure so what I'm gonna do is actually check that tablet so how do I make this thing I need some stone seeds and old root I think I got all of that somewhere I got the old root for sure somewhere over the rainbow where are you let's grab some stone uh, old root in here old root old root all right and then some seeds. So this should make that tablet. Uh, the crafting table should be boom, boom, boom. Was it that? I'm bad to remember that stuff. No, that was nowhere close. Okay, runic tablet. So if I remember right, it's not here, here. It should be. I don't remember which one of these is actually is. is this it? Oh, petal dust right here. So something like this stuff. So I need to make... Now, I don't know which petal dust it wants me to make, actually. Because there's several varieties, I think. Which is a problem. But... Depending on the recipe... It doesn't have any requirements, so I might be actually be able to do this pretty easily. Let's see, what can we do? What's something cheap? I need a mortar, I need a red tulip, another brick, nope, can't do that one. Uh, that one? Nope. What's the first one? Nope. Mm. I need a poppy, a mushroom, and some raw beef. I think I could do that. I have a poppy, don't I? I have a poppy. I know there's a cow nearby. Mm. But the problem is a mushroom. Where am I going to find a mushroom at? Do I have any mushrooms in here already? No, of course not. Mm hmm. So maybe it'll be a little adventure for some mushrooms. Or, let's see if there's anything else I could use. I keep skipping it. Uh, nope. 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 Oh, if I could find a white tulip. That will work. A white tulip would work. Mm hmm. Okay, let's go find some mushrooms or some white tulips. Alrighty, we have returned. And while I was out looking around for mushrooms, I decided to look through some more of these uh, spells that gave me the petal dust. This one's actually a lot easier to get. And I'm thinking it should still work. So why didn't I just do this? Because I saw plenty of chickens, I got plenty of string, and I know there's plenty of dandelions. So I grabbed all of that stuff. And now all I need to do is make a mortar. So I thought this was the one I needed, and it, it, it it's not. So I have to actually make a uh, mortar from the actual roots mod, which it kind of stands to reason that's how you do it. So I need to go out and find some more diorite to make the last pestle part that I needed. So what I think it happens is I just have to put this down and then... 
Okay, okay, okay. And then I just hit it with the pestle? No. Shift right click? No. Hmm. What am I supposed to do? I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this, actually. Can I... Mm hmm. No. Dandelion wind. Use the most recipe and craft that. So it's dandelion, feather, string, and feather. So it's dandelion, string, feather, and then smack it. No. How does this work? Oh, I need an old root too. Okay, I guess that makes sense. So you, 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 and then old root. And then smack with the pestle. There we go. Aha. So, petal dust. Now that I have the petal dust, let's grab some of our tin. And can I make the atmospheric thingy, my bob? So, petal dust like that. Cool, got a compass, and then I need to grab some of the copper. So there's two like that, compass like that, and boom. Sweet. We got ourselves an atmospheric gauge. Now how does this work? Uh, let's go down. So for ember to work, it needs to be at the bottom bottom. Like a, can't tell if that thing's moving or not. Hmm. This mod pack. How do you work? Free song on your journey. Da da da. Create an absurd gate to find a top where there's normal heat from the core. And for all the journey, you'll need to go out and explore your absurd gate, looking for a chunk where ember is detected. So I need to go to different chunks. So I can actually do that above ground. All right. Well, I'm not going to do that quite yet. There are other things I still want to do. All right. So some other things I wanted to do is I wanted to kind of automate the collection of this, um, these strainer bases. It is getting quite annoying to come over and just like, kind of like go into it and pull everything out. And I do remember reading that I should be able to pull out the stuff with a hopper. So like say for this, if I want to put it... I guess for the time being, let's like say there's gonna be a chest there. I can do that. And so that should pull everything out. Yes, it does. All right. So what I need to do is make some more of these hoppers. And that's one of the reasons why I've been kind of stockpiling all of that tin to make some more of these things. So let's grab some more you and then let's make a couple more chests. So let's do that. Let's make one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. Okay, perfect. And actually, I do. Wait, what? Oh, that's kind of cool. Convert it into a different chest. So then do that. And then do that and that. So that should get everything going into one spot. Now, the only thing I probably should do is change out that fishing one to not to be a fishing one because I will kind of add the amount of space I need. That's a pretty basic step forward. So let's make a couple more of those strings thingies. Let's grab some you. It's more woven cloth. Ba -ba -ba -da, ba -da -ba -da. Perfect. Then make some of you. Uh, can I make as much as, as I can, please? Like that. That and then boom. Perfect. Might be a little overkill, but uh, whatever. Okay, perfect. Boom, boom, and boom. So that should help me greatly without having to always check on that stuff. Perfect. Alright, so the next thing I wanted to do is... Let's put you away. So before I actually go looking for iron, or try to like, you know, set up a system where I can smelt iron, which is the whole point of this metallurgic mechanician stuff, and the whole point of this atmospheric thermometer, or gauge, 
I need to make these ember boar stuff, which doesn't look too difficult, but I think I'll end up doing this off camera. But I do want to do on camera, that is, is there's a mod I was looking at because one of the things I thought of is, okay, I can smelt uh, iron, fine, but how am I going to mine it? How do I get iron? Because none of the iron blocks I found are mineable by the flint stuff. And it's like, okay. So I was looking around through pickaxes of what I could do. Pick axes. Pickaxe. Okay. So I was like, okay, I can't do the wooden axe. Uh, I can't do iron unless I go find some iron from zombies, which was, I guess, an option. I could make a mob farm. But I was going through them all. I'm like, no, I can't do any of these. Too difficult, too difficult. Some of them I thought would be pretty good, like... This nether quartz was like, I actually can't go to the nether yet. But then I came across something called the reinforced pick. And I was like, you know what? I wonder if that will work. So I did a little bit of a looking of what a reinforced pickaxe is from the calculator mod. And apparently it should work. And the calculator mod is something I've never heard of. And I'm not quite sure how it works. So we are going to be looking at the calculator mod for the rest of the day. So to make a calculator... To make the calculator mod work, we need something called a calculator, which could store power, but I don't know what it means. It does you do not need to generate power to use the calculator. It's like, um, okay, weird. And that, it's kind of funny though, it starts with 100 power. How does it get power from stones? How does stones make power? And uh, I can't answer that. So one of the reasons why I've been making all this stone because it's something I've been wanting to do. All right, so we have our basic gear. We have our stones, that. We just need this calculator assembly. So it needs a whole bunch of buttons. And I mean a whole bunch of buttons. So hopefully this will be enough. I think I need eight. Oh, perfect. That's as many as I needed. Two, 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 two. And then fill you up like that to get the button or calculator assembly. So now all I have to do is voila i got myself a calculator how do you work stored power 100 starts with power to use i thought you'd have to right click it to work maybe not hey look it it works so i guess i was just being a little stupid but that's all right we figured it out it didn't take that long so to make the reinforced stone that I need for the w p tools, I'll, <laughs> I'll stumble over my words again. Whoa. You know what? Maybe I should make a whole bunch of this stuff. How much reinforced stone do I need? I need a wood pile, which I got plenty of wood. So let's just actually turn this whole stack into like a wood pile. And then a whole bunch of cobblestone, which I don't have as much of anymore. But I should have enough to get a good start. So let's uh, compress all of that. Ba -ba -da -ba. Okay, that should be that should be a good start. Okay, <sighs> Enderman, please don't pick up anything, please. Oh, and now that's dark, I might not be able to do anything. Or maybe I can't click on anything. Hold on. Oh. Okay, I'm just dumb. You can't be facing any blocks. You have to be facing open air. So it's not even the solar thing. Ooh, that's embarrassing. Oh, well, whatever. I, I figured that out too. Yay, I figured things out. Woo. Yeah, my goodness, I'm so... Uh, that can be kind of ridiculous sometimes. So, let's take our reinforced stone, get our sticks, and we get something called the reinforced pickaxe. Getting an upgrade. So let's take a look at you. Uh, you look pretty interesting. Mm-hmm. So let's see, what can it mine? Let's go down here. There is stuff down here that only a... It's not that one. So, so this is pickaxe level iron. This is the same level that iron needs. So... Perfect! Process in a mineral, mineral sizer. What is a mineral sizer? So many things to try out. But, so, uh, this thing will work pretty well. It's actually a lot faster than the flint one, too. 
nifty little upgrade. Uh, anything that's on there? No. All right, good. So that works fine. So what else can this calculator mod do, though? That is the question. <laughs> oh, the reinforced sword looks so ridiculous. I do like how it looks, though. There's no block. There's no block. All right. Let's see. Obsidian key. Nope. 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 Pickaxe. I wonder how well these axes work. Compared to, like, the axe I currently have. 7 attack damage, 28 attack speed. Ew. That attack damage sucks. Shovel's nice. Ho. Don't really care about that. Let's look at... Can you actually show me what you do? All right. Compressed cobblestone sat, stable glass, reinforced stone brick, rain, rain sensor. Hmm. Scarecrow. Ooh, I might want to make that eventually. Hay bale, pumpkin, don't have any of that stuff yet, though. Reinforced third, broccoli seeds. How does seeds plus pumpkin make broccoli? That's not how any of this works. Stable stone, sickle. A sickle. A wrench. Can I, what do I use a wrench for? Baby grenade. Oh. I need to get gunpowder. I need to make this. Because that sounds fun. That sounds so much fun. Okay, let's go back and look at the wrench. What are you used for, wrench? Um, well, I guess I could combine the stuff I currently have. Uh, I can always just make the stuff again, right? Uh, let's do that. So combine you with you. Oh, does it have to be not damaged? That's probably the case. Um, screw it. Let's just make it. Let's just make the wrench and see what it's used for. Oh, I guess you, you can't make the wrench. Or am I missing? No, you can. Okay. Wrench. What can I use you for? Why would you make it if you don't know what it's used for? Because I can, and it looks neat. Uh, now it just kind of looks like a baton in there. So can you break things quick? Nope. Uh, well, that might have been a waste. Whatever. So, mm -hmm. yes, I finally found you. <laughs> oh, I get to have some fun with this before we go. Yes. All right, and we have returned. That was quite the quite the lengthy expedition to find some pumpkins because that's the thing I really wanted to do. I wanted to play around with the pumpkins because the scarecrow. I was like, you know what? I'm going to finish today by uh, making myself a scarecrow for my garden. Oh, man, that took a while. I don't know how long it actually took, but it was like two night cycles. So uh, quite a bit of time. But yeah, throughout my adventures, I did find a uh, village and I did raid some iron chess piece stuff. So that's pretty nice and some flippers. But like I did kind of suspect, I think they nerfed how rewards work for villages because there was no smeltery, which I guess it could have just been bad RNG. And the engineer's house that usually has a whole bunch of ore inside their crates didn't have anything. They had like blueprints, which was still good, but eh, not not the best. But anyway, so now that we're back, I can now add together some pumpkin seeds with some skis and get myself some broccoli. So one of the reasons why I want broccoli, actually let's make the rest of the broccoli, is because of something that broccoli can be used to make. So I was going through and I saw something called the fiddler fruit and I was like, oh my geez, look at all of that food and saturation. That'd be perfect to add to my uh, little uh, garden of food supply. So it's a uh, broccoli plus broccoli divided by broccoli plus broccoli. I don't know why that works the way it works, but whatever. But I do need something called the Flawless Calculator, which I'm assuming is probably, oh yeah, way out of uh, my part of the game. God, end diamond? How do I get end diamond? Atomic Calculator, end stone plus electric diamond plus obsidian. What is electric diamond? Fire diamond. Conductor mast. Is that also this mod pack? It is. Oh my goodness so diamond blaze rod plus diamond equals fire diamond that is quite the progression a lot of these mods have uh, very serious grindy bits and just lengthiness 
All right, so we got the broccoli. Let's plant those. Maybe they can, hopefully they can plant in here. All right. I wonder how long they'll take to grow. Ow. Stupid ender lily. Hmm. I should put a worm down, but then they'll uproot that. Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. So then I can also add together some wheat. So let's make a hay bale. Hay bale, bale, hay bale. Perfect. So it should be pumpkin plus hay bale. Is that what it was? Yes. Returning feature. I got the scarecrow. Let's put you up somewhere. Where's a good spot? Where's a good spot? Ah, uh, why not? <gasps> You're beautiful. I thought you growled at me for a second. Hey, get out of here. I'm admiring my scarecrow. I see you in the darkness. You can't hit me. Aha. Aha. Oh. Aha. Ha. Yes. Kill the skeleton for me. Perfect. You are... Kind of spooky. <sighs> I want that. Is there anything out there? Uh... Let's do it. Where'd it go? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, wait, where did... Where did the thing go? Oh. <gasps> oh! Aha! Loser. All right. So that is all the time I have for today. Uh, there's a lot more exploring than I really expected. But uh, thank you all for joining me. If you enjoyed the video, please hit like. And if you like to not subscribe, please do. If you have any comments, feedback, or suggestions, leave it down in the comment section down below. Until next episode, my friends, I will see you guys later. Bye-bye. Oh, you're so cool. I wonder if you actually do anything.